Yeah, my name is Caitlin Stout. I'm a senior at Spring Arbor University. I'm studying sociology with a minor in urban studies. Um, I am passionate about LGBT activism and uh, rights, especially for students on Christian campuses. And I'm planning on going to seminary after I'm done here. Yeah, to other queer students, not only on Spring Arbor's campus, but on any Christian campus, I think um, I would just want to say that you deserve the full rights that any other student has. Um, you deserve to be seen, you deserve to be appreciated for who you are and not despite who you are. And I would also want to say that uh, there is life outside of your campus. Uh, it does get better and that there are churches and faith communities who will appreciate you and love you fully. And even if you don't feel that right now, know that that exists and that there are people who are fighting for you. LGBT students and LGBT issues are not going away and it's not something that is going to uh, just be able to be ignored after a few good conversations. Um, the church is definitely moving in a direction of acceptance for LGBT people and I think that that is a beautiful thing. But the longer we resist these conversations and the more we pretend that it's not a real issue, the quicker that our institution is going to become irrelevant and the sooner we're not going to be able to do any more good for the kingdom of God. Um, so my words to administration would just be to cultivate these conversations, uh, give space to queer students to share these stories in a safe and affirming way, and I think that uh, Spring Arbor will move in a beautiful and good direction. Um, I think Spring Arbor has made me a better Christian, and Spring Arbor has taught me what community should look like, but maybe not in the way that Spring Arbor expected <laughs> or... Uh, would have hoped to teach me those lessons. Um, I think, I, I always tell people that uh, it's my little LGBT family, my little queer family who has shown me what the church should look like. And um, in the face of a lot of hardship and frustration uh, with this institution, I have definitely learned to see the face of Christ in my uh, fellow LGBT um, Christian friends. And we've learned how to laugh together and rejoice together and lament together and that's been a beautiful thing and I've just really learned while at the school how to, I don't know, lean on others for strength and support and I have learned uh, what ministry looks like from a position of marginalization and how to walk with others through difficult times without having it all figured out myself um, and that has been a good and hard thing but my time at Spring Arbor has definitely made me a better person, and even though it hasn't been easy or fun all the time, I'm thankful for that.